welcome back. Okay, we're still in the world of Get Famous. We're doing the park because I wanted something quick and easy. I didn't realize at the time, but the park's name is Ward Park. So it's clearly named after Judith Ward. I wanted to make this park um, a little bit more fancier than what it was before. It just kind of looked like very random <laughs> in Los Angeles. Oh, a Los Angeles stylized city. So I was just like, mm, uh, let's make it look a little better. So that's what I did. Um, I made like a little bathroom area because honestly, when you're at a park, every park should have a toilet. <laughs> Uh, I do think it was like a national park before, so there's only three requirements, which was really weird. Instead of just like a park, so I uh, went ahead and um, changed it over to a park. So it, like it requires like the chess table and a playground and the bathroom. It just felt better. Um, I tried to make the bathrooms feel a little on the expensive side, but like not too expensive if you get my drift um but i really wanted to kind of structuralize this park because any park i've been to in a big city is pretty structured like it's not just like a willy-nilly little parking type situation so i really am very lucky that <laughs> How I planned it actually worked for me because um, this lot is very small. It is very small. And I think any other ideal that I had would have backfired immediately on this park. Um, but you're kind of seeing me try to figure out, like, what am I, what am I doing? <laughs> What's going on? Um, but yeah. So this park is going to include um, chess tables. There is a monkey bars and jungle gym for kids. Um, there's picnic tables and grills. There's a bathroom. There's also a woodworking table here. I thought it was like a cute little thing to add because um, like maybe the gardener, like that's the little gardener section. But uh, anyways. Um, and then, yeah, I just kind of structured in everything with, like, bushes. I added in palm trees because before the lot had, like, pine trees on it. I mean, this is a world based on L.A. When have you seen a pine tree? <laughs> so I did um, some palm trees and I did, like, uh fake little planner boxes for them which um you saw last week with the museum i did the same thing kind of there so i'm like bringing that in at the same time just to kind of like keep everything like cohesive but here we are like this uh this seems so much better almost um and that, that's kind of why I was just like, oh, I'm going to structure it like this. This seems logical. Um, and I do put sand in the kid area in like a fake p sand pit type thing. If you have Island Living, you can actually use that to like make sand castles and things. Um, so that's kind of why I include it nowadays. Like aesthetically, it fills up a spot, but play style wise, it actually is usable if you have Island Living. So... Um, that being said, it's basically just a little park here. So why don't we just head into the live overview real quick. All right. And here we are, the Ward Park. Um, it blends so much better compared to how it was before. Uh, but it is very simple. It is so simple. Um, so let's just have like a quick little overview. We have the chess tables here in the nice little community garden section. We have the play area. Uh, this is functional. I did play test this. Your kid sims will use this very easily. Um, and again, monkey bars, 
and sand pit if you have the island living. And you come over here and we just have a couple places to sit, a couple of grills, and then we have the bathrooms and the um, handiness bench, carpentry bench. And uh, yeah, and again, I pull in the pine pine trees in the planter there. I do have them here as well, not in a planter because I couldn't fit it, but I felt like this really worked. So it quite matches. And this, this park just feels better. It feels better than what was here. It's more structured. It, there's pavement. It's just, it, it feels better. So yeah, it's very simple. Um, and then there is not a lot of light at night, but I did put a bunch of these in. You could take them out if you want to, but, uh, I think it looks really good. It really reminds me of a park that I live close to. So that's why I, I just packed this one. <laughs> Anyways, it's going to be on my gallery, gallery D is T-U-B-A-E-E, -E. um, and yeah, I hope you enjoy it if you download it, and with that, I will see you in the next video. Bye, everyone.